It might come as a surprise that although all are part of the radiology technology family, the techniques and technologies are vastly different for ultrasound, MRI, and X-ray scans. Ultrasound is different from X-ray, uh, being that we use sound waves to visualize our internal organs. We don't look at bones. We use a transducer, which is a little device, like a little wand that we use with a water-based gel. And we put it on the area that we're, we're looking at, like say the abdomen. Um, what happens is the transducer shoots out sound waves and the sound waves bounce off internal organs and it shows us the image on the screen and that's what we'll see on the screen. In the ultrasound we have to do so much more than just take pictures. We provide quality care to the patient. We constantly make independent decisions in the scope of the procedure based on our findings and we have to communicate with the doctors. The diagnostic medical sonography program uh, lasts about 18 months depends on different programs. Some programs will take about one year up to four years to get a bachelor degree. The prerequisites could take from high school diploma to certain specific qualifications in allied health programs. The careers for ultrasonographers are expanding with every year as the technology expands. So even in the, in the tough market, the opportunities are excellent. Uh, the salaries in the field of sonography are very competitive and sometimes could be even higher for the specialists with the similar degrees. Sonographers can work full-time, part-time, or as contract employees and may travel abroad to outside healthcare facilities. There are even opportunities to work with mobile imaging service providers, serving patients in areas that require treatment via mobile diagnostic imaging equipment. Another benefit, among others, is an unexpected one. Working in this profession, you will definitely stay in shape. I mean, we do have to lift 50 pounds routinely, push, pull, bend, stoop. We use both of our hands, arms, and shoulders, and wrists, and we work standing about 80% of the time. The sonography industry and careers for sonographers are dynamic and constantly advancing with rapidly developing new technologies and increased use of diagnostic ultrasound procedures, growth is projected to continue well into the future. Sonographers can choose to work not only in clinics, hospitals, private practice physician offices, laboratories, and other medical settings, but also in education, administration, research, and in commercial companies or technical advisors. For information on becoming a registered diagnostic medical sonographer, visit the following. For more information about Gurnick Academy, visit us at medacademy.org. For a current list of accredited education programs in diagnostic medical sonography, visit the following.